Hey everybody, this is Erica from the Classy Climb blog coming today with the question, Erica, not everyone is meant to be a business owner. What's your thoughts? Okay. Hmm. What's my thoughts? That's true. That's true. Not everyone is meant to be a business owner. What I am saying is if you have that desire that it's so you can see something and be like, I could do that better. I could provide a a cheaper product, a better product, a more polished product, go into business. That's a lot of things I saw when I was inside the apartment industry. I could start a construction company that did um, uh, cleaned up apartments, painted apartments. I could do that better, faster, quicker, and cheaper than they're doing. And I could give great quality customer service. And so that's what started me there. Um, as far as a person who's like, I just don't like entrepreneurship. I don't want to be responsible. I'd rather go inside of a structured, nice company with the security and build it from the inside and just be an inside person, which is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. There are a lot of people with that great gift and talent. You need them. You need wall builders. You need people that stand out in the front. Um, what I would say to that person is make sure you're getting every uh, possible tax break possible as far as your wa4 make sure it's properly filled out also set up a lending club account a e-trade or ameritrade you got a couple different options there and i would be immediately uh investing my money three or four ways honestly i'd be getting some precious metals very few i'd get with silver gold's a little expensive at the moment um i'd get uh, gold or i'd get you know one tenth an ounce of silver uh, one tenth an ounce of gold I would get a lending club account and buy notes at 25 starting at $25 a pop. Great interest, anywhere from 10-15%. Um, I would get a monthly dividend stock. <laughs> you know, I would, I would pick a company. I would actually pick 10 companies and I would buy one a month or one a week. You know, if you only have 100 bucks here or there, I'd do that. Um, I would also invest in... Um, you know some things like let's say i go to yard sales i like going to yard sales and i find things i like i would turn around and sell them on amazon i turn around and sell them on ebay i turn around and sell them on craigslist you know old phones or whatever anything and i'd find a niche for myself where i'm not in business necessarily for myself but i'm making income and i'm growing my income because for a lot of people they don't take trips they don't take vacations and they don't eat out at great restaurants why well i don't have the money to do that well you're shortening the mental map of what you think your life could be so listen, it, entrepreneurship is not for everybody. Starting a business is not for everybody. But for those who like to literally go to work and whine and complain nonstop and say how they could do something better, well, get off your ass and do it. So again, this is Erica from the Classy Kind blog. Do not, do not um, sit at a job you hate when you know you could have the skills to do it better. Point blank period. But everybody is not meant for entrepreneurship. Uh, this is Erica from the Classy Kind blog. That's classyscl.com. You guys have a great day.